Chrissy Crew, this is the last of it. This is such a process to go through all this stuff. <laughs> oh, Lord. Okay. All right. Speaking of chicken fillies, you guys, we got to have the bread. And I'm going to show you guys these awesome hoagies that are so cheap. I mean, they come from Walmart. Yes, fresh from the Walmart bakery. You six white sub rolls. I want to do they sell the wheat because that would just be over the top if they sold the wheat ones. Because that's what I go when I go to Subway. I go, I buy the wheat subs. So when I say these are soft and good though, we be putting our um our Philly cheese steaks um on these. But we're gonna do some chicken like I showed y'all in the last video. We're gonna do some chicken subs. And I'm going to show you guys the cheese that I got with it. The right kind of cheese you're supposed to do with it. It's a bag full of dairy here. Cheese and everything. I'm going to pull this out in just a moment, you guys. All right. I kind of arranged them so we can kind of just see what we got here. Provolone. I got the Sargento natural cheese. I didn't even know what provolone is before I worked at Washington University years ago up there. Um at the um at the lunch room there i was a lunch yeah i was a lunch lady i was a young lunch lady i should have been in school just like them but provolone that's some good old cheese that's the cheese that they put on philly cheese they that white cheese it's that round cheese it's italian and um i got some sliced kobe jack now now that sagento was two dollars and 97 cent not bad at all they had the great value kind for like a dollar less. But I said, I might as well get the Sargento. And then they have uh, this. I think this is like a dollar seventy-seven for this sliced Kobe Jack. You get 12 slices in there. More than enough. It'd be big. Um, and I don't eat sandwiches like that. And I just, I really just use those slices just for sandwiches. Uh, I got two Philly, Philly cream cheeses. I wanted to get four. But I'm going to have, I'm going to make my nephew a cheese. I'm going to have his mom get some cream cheese. And this cream cheese be so high. It'd be so hot. I got some unsalted butter because I do plan on making me some uh, homemade chocolate chip cookies. And I will uh, probably go live when I make those. And I want to try to film it too. So, uh, yes. Um, yep, that's for my Philly cheese steak. I mean, uh, my chicken Philly that I plan on making. All right. It looks like this is the salmon, some fresh salmon. This stuff be so high, y'all, but it is so good. Some good salmon. I got the skin on salmon. Um, Atlantic salmon. And uh, this is 841. Looks so fresh and good. Look at that. Got the skin on. Looks delicious. I love me some salmon. Won't this? I end up always having to put it back. Because I'll be having to make sure that we have other kind of meats. I said, I'm going to get this next time. I'm trying to eat better, y'all. I don't know if I want to grill it or how I want it. I'm probably going to end up grilling it. I want to try to keep it healthy. All right, we got chicken leg quarters. If you want to stretch your dollar, if you want to have uh, enough meat to last for a while, at, buy a couple of these if you have a family. But be, be, with it being just me and my daughter, this will last us forever. I think it got about eight of these in here. So you get uh, essentially eight legs and eight thighs. You can't believe that. This is $8 and, and some change for this bag, y'all. And I've seen it cheaper than this. I used to go to Aldi's and save a lot. And a bag like this was, I'm telling you, no lie would be like, I want to say five some six some dollars. So they just done went up on it. Even with them going up on it, it's still super economical. It's no reason for not to have enough food in your icebox. You get this. And you get you some potatoes. That's where I keep my potatoes at down here. I always keep them in a, try to keep them in a cool, dark place. And I got them in that crate down there. I put my onions down there too. Um, also, this is the last of this stuff, y'all. Let's get to the last little bit of this stuff. And this is some kosher deal spears. These are real good to snack on. And I think this jar, let's see, how much was this jar? It wasn't that much at all. I want to say, I know, I want to say it was below $4. Uh, don't quote me on that. I want to say it was below $4. And it's Vlasic. These are the pickle spears. This is nice to have with your sandwich. 
and uh, my friend gonna be glad to see me. <laughs> she gonna glad, be glad to see this without my next, my last, my last thing that I'm gonna put up here. And I've been promising to buy, promising to buy. I finally bought me some apple cider, Bragg's apple cider vinegar. Now this is the small jar. I wanted to get the big jar. The big jar was like six dollars or something. But we're trying to get all this other stuff. Um. And I'm trying to see whether I should put it in my smoothie. And I might put a little bit of this in my smoothie. I don't know how much I should put in there, though. Maybe a fourth of a cup. I might put I might put that over there with the smoothie stuff. As I finna film the smoothie video in a moment here. And um, have my brunch. Um, but yeah, I got this. Because uh, I need to treat my feet, y'all. Um, of course, I need to lose weight. They say this is a game changer as far as losing weight. Uh, please comment below on any of these. Um, um, I was gonna say objects <laughs> on any of these products. Hallelujah! That I have presented here today is I try to um, I try to uh, you know just kind of explain to y'all uh, why I buy things and what I plan on um, using them for in the future and everything. And um, I like watching uh, haul videos. I consider this an online grocery haul video, the grocery haul delivery video. As a matter of fact, yep. So when you um when you do shop, always shop with uh, meals in mind, and 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 things that you would need to cook with, and things you do you would need to make a meal with, because it's I believe so many people waste their EBT and their cash and their credit or whatever they buy their food with. Um, not carefully planning their meals. So, uh, yeah, it, uh, hopefully I gave you some ideas. Look out for, um, I'm doing a live event for the first half of this video on my Cooking with Chrissy on Facebook. Um, and it's going to lead you to the video right on YouTube for the first half. And this is the second half right here. Um, Cooking with Chrissy in the Lou. Uh, Walmart Plus shopping online delivery, online grocery delivery haul. Because I always order online and it's my groceries and they deliver it to my house. So uh, please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, hit that notification bell so you can get any kind of notifications of any new video. Because I never know when I'm going to do a video. It's a couple of videos I want to shoot today, though, because I want to do my cleaning with Chrissy, um, for my floor. I want to do my, uh, cleaning and deck cleaning slash decoration video for me to finally, I finally got, I believe a shower curtain that will accommodate my bathroom. I want to, I want y'all to see me transform my bathroom, um, and finally finish it off. I have, uh, washed the little rugs that I had in there. Um, I've been had my shower curtain that I was going to put up. So I wanted you all to just kind of see that, see how I'm going to have my little new bathroom, my new place. But please like, share, and subscribe. Trying to get these subscriptions up. Trying to get these likes up. Let me know if you like it. Comment, please. And share, share, share. God bless you guys. And if you guys want to support me, dollar sign Crystal Thomas 47. That's my cash app. Um, if you guys ever want to give me any kind of equipment, because all kind of equipment that I need so I can make even better recipes, bigger recipes. Uh, more often than everything, feel free to do that. You can reach out to me on my email, crystalwagner37 at yahoo.com. God bless you guys and have a great, great weekend. Ciao.